Hello everyone, Shinobi here once again with another Awakened Chaos Era video. Yeah, so today I was testing out all those Attack on Titan heroes that we got from the impending crisis. So I was testing them out, uh, especially my Levi on Tulpa and all the three Levi, Eren and Mikasa in Witch of the Wind. Um, unfortunately, I did not have enough stats for doing Witch of the Wind 16, but I was able to get a consistent run on Witch of the Wind 15, right? So let me just quickly show you how I'm going to use them, how they are synergizing with each other, and then we will go and do a Witch of the, run, uh, sorry, Witch of the Wind 15 run using uh, Eren, Mikasa, and Levi, and also do another run in Tulpa with... Uh, with Levi on there, okay? So this uh, is the gear that I'm going to give for my Aaron, uh, and that's because in which of the wind, as you know, you do require pretty high speed. And that's why my attack is not that high. I need it a little bit more higher for me uh, to deal with which of the wind 16. Um, at this moment, my attack is around 4,000. Sorry, let me just move myself again. Uh, yeah. So my um, attack is around 4,333 on my um, Aaron. I need to get that somewhere around 5,000 to deal with which other wind uh, 16, which is a bit high. Okay, you need to get speed, you need to get crit rate, you need to get crit damage. Um, fortunately, uh, I do not. I did not see any requirement for focus over here. Uh, even the focus on Aaron would be good because he also deals uh, random. Uh, negative effect on the uh, boss on the whoever he's attacking so getting him focus would be good but for Mikasa I saw that she's got pretty low focus and she was still able to deal her bleeds okay so this is the stats of my Aaron uh, so let's quickly look at Mikasa um, so this was her gear that I used on her uh, she's got 301 crit damage, 229 speed, 3340 attack, and 10% focus. And she was still able to deal the bleeds on Witch of the Wind at 15, right? So I don't think I'd require a lot of focus over here on Mikasa, because from whatever I, I have seen, she was dealing the bleeds there, and I was getting those <clears throat> ultimates from Aaron over there. So I, I'm pretty sure you should be able to do uh, give this kind of a gear on her and then get things done yeah uh for my levi let me just quickly show you my levi as well so he has got a curse set on him because i was using him uh on uh tulpa as well in in a curse set i just removed his attack boot and changed it into speed boot so he's got 217 speed 275 crit damage um Little bit of focus again, 11.5 focus and 4000 attack. If I'm able to get these stats to uh, say around 5000 attack for all three of them, then I should be able to. I don't know, I'm just assuming here because I have not been having a successful uh, which other than 16 run using these guys. Um, so I wanted to test what was shown in the video, right? So I wanted to show that. And I unfortunately I could not get that done at which other win 16, but at 15 I was able to do that. Um, so let's quickly look at um, Levi's skill because he's the main hero that I'm going to showcase here. I'm also showcasing him on uh, Tulpa. So let's first look at that and then we will go to which other win. Okay. So he's got an ultimate, which is Deathly Spiral. It deals 200% damage to one enemy and removes two positive effect on them with a chance to additional, additionally deal five times of damage to them. Damage and trigger chance scales with enemies lost health. So that's why he's so good in Tulpa. I've seen him deal that five uh, times damage. That is around thousand percent damage of his ultimate dealt in one go on the boss right so he that but that's it but that is a chance okay it's not a guaranteed thing and that's the problem okay uh and then his uh flying blade is special flying blade it deals 150 percent damage to an enemy and applies accuracy down for one turn grants attack up for three turns so basically this is a permanent attack up on uh levi 
but during which other event she places um, you know no positive effects on um, the debuff on us so it causes a bit of problem there and his double slash his main basic ability it deals 100% damage to one enemy and reduces their max health by 50% of the damage dealt to as low as 50% of their max health so again he's so good at Tulpa because of this because he's able to deal uh, reduce those max HP from Tulpa but in which other wind um, you have only one health bar and so it's not going to be that much of a uh, benefit there but at the same time it's still good right you're still getting something out of it and his trait again it's awesome Levi has 60% chance to dodge the incoming attack and launches a counter attack with basic ability the chance is reduced by 20% per successful dodge uh, to as low as 20% and is reset on enemy kills okay so those are levi's abilities that i am using um, for me to get uh, things done out there and which are the win i want to go directly to which are the win because spending time on discussing other heroes um, uh, skills would be like taking a lot of time and the video will be pretty long uh, basically you know the trade and ultimate of Aaron and that's what I'm basically using you can check out my video uh, previous videos on that uh, so his trade and rage uh, is a wonderful a beautiful beautiful unique skill I'm <coughs> sorry and thankful for uh, Ace for making such a beautiful hero who has got such a lot of synergy with a lot of heroes over here and Mikasa again her trade is so good she just places this entrusted on uh, and uh, on one of the ally and that's so beautiful you know it, it also enhances their attack and also uh, makes them joint attack with them and she's also counter attacking uh, the person uh, who hits the ally and so that's just a wonderful wonderful trade uh, her ultimate is also just as sweet um, you know deals 200 percent damage to one enemy damage scales with number of bleeding stacks on the target if the number of bleeding stacks is equal to or above six these abilities cooldown is reduced by two turns so an, an awesome awesome champions okay the only thing is that uh, they are all single target and i think like their um, damage multiplier should have been tweaked a little bit more but at the same time it's fine so let's just quickly look at uh, which other wind uh, 15 and let's see um, the kind of damage these guys are dealing. Of course, I'm using Flarence. So if you do not have Flarence, it, I don't think this comp is going to work. Uh, but yeah, anyways, I'm just testing all these champions over here and seeing if they are viable in these dungeons. So I think like, uh, yeah, uh, these heroes are viable even in which other in 16. I just need to get a little bit more stuff. Maybe uh, 4,500, 600 attack on them, a little bit more crit damage, a little bit more... Uh, speed on them and I think like it should be uh, a very very viable team composition when it comes to which other wind 16 but as of now which other wind 15 is perfectly feasible with that kind of stat but still it's, it's still a very very high stat that we are talking about right getting 220 and about speed 200 I got only 217 speed on my uh, on my Levi um, but at the same time, yeah, you need somewhere around 220 and um, 221 speed. If you have that, then you will take less damage from the boss, right? So even her bleeds, um, you will be taking less damage because of the speed difference between the boss and you. So you don't want that uh, very high speed difference between you and the boss. Otherwise, you're going to die. Um, so it's better that in which other way you give them a huge amount of speed but as i said again i do not i do not see a requirement for a lot of focus in which of the wind uh, because i was able to um, land the bleeds on the boss without that kind of a focus you can see there goes mikasa she dealt that bleed she's again uh, uh, placing bleeds without any problem right so uh, the stacks i think like the yeah I do think that these stacks have not come through. They got only she's got only like two stacks out there. Instead of three or four stacks, she's got only two stacks. So I do have an issue with that. But still, she was able to place that um, bleed with ten focus. So I think like I should be giving her a little bit more focus, possibly twenty or thirty, to get that kind of a uh, you know increased chance to land that bleed. Um, I'm, but at the same time, if I reduce 
wait a second, I think like I should be able to do that, right? So I don't need a lot of attack on her because the main damage is not coming from uh, the damage from bleed. It's mainly from Levi and uh, from Aaron. But at the same time, she's also dealing pretty high damage. Her ultimate deals a lot of damage. So if she doesn't have a lot of attack on her, I'm not sure if uh, her damage will reduce, but then her damage, that additional damage is based on the number of uh, debuffs that bleeds on the boss right so i think like we can reduce a little bit more of her attack and give her a little bit more focus so that she consistently places those bleeds on the boss and then when she deals the ultimate she should be able to deal a lot more damage because uh, she's going to get any half going to get those kind of stacks on the boss so it's better to give her a lot more stacks of um, bleed rather than not have sufficient stacks uh, and anyways if she gets more stacks then her ultimate cooldown is also getting reduced so that means she's going to deal a lot more damage from her ultimate so i think uh, i should be reducing a little bit more attack but uh, we will have to work out a little bit more but at the same time uh, this team composition as i said is is a viable kind of team composition which you can use uh, to finish off each other in 15 and 16 or probably uh, if you are having sufficient um, attack on um, attack and damage ability, uh, on these heroes uh, that is one of those uh, you know situations where you know where the where levi goes and hits minions that's what i don't like even though i have selected the uh, the boss to be you know like the oh uh, the first primary target but still it seems like levi just deviates and hits somebody else which i don't like you know i have given the boss as the uh, primary target and that's where he should be going and he goes and hits the minion that's not something i like and you must have seen that uh, additional bonus damage dealt by levi that dealt with uh which of the wind which with the cre uh with the boss so that's what levi is good for right so yeah so that's how i was able to finish off which other wind using uh th this comp and this is uh um, the comp that i saw in the video of levi you know like levi mikasa and uh aaron going in and dealing with which other wind and i like i was trying to get that thing done but unfortunately other than um, using flarence we do not have any other option uh to finish off the boss so you can see the amount of damage that has been dealt by these guys over here huge amount of damage dealt by these guys okay so i'll quickly um, change my gear a little bit on my levi and then show you the tulpa run as well so that you know we can test them out there in tulpa as well of course mikasa and um mikasa and uh aaron are not going to be there in tulpa oh no i don't want to do that now right i have to change the gear okay so i'll just quickly change the gear and get back to you soon okay so let's look at tulpa and see how levi is able to handle this one um so my team i'm using flarence bachelorard bella and levi so flarence obviously is the most valuable player at the moment in this game um and bella is a synthesizable hero so you can get it um free to play within the game and she's one of the uh, she's the best one here available for tulpa and bachelor art is obviously from the magic pass okay so in the current magic pass you are getting bachelor art you can use him along with you know uh levi and obviously levi is from the event hero so let's see how this team functions okay so Florence goes in places that decrease uh, increase damage taken on everybody and then bella goes in and deals a lot more damage there and yeah you do have that beautiful uh work from levi because he's got those dodge on him he just is able to counterattack if he's being attacked and bachelor is um absolutely wonderful okay we i'll show you the gear that i'm using on these guys uh at the um end of this run okay uh, i should have shown you uh in the first but yeah i'll just show it to you at the end so i'll be showing all the gear on all the heroes that i'm using um tulpa is very difficult to be it if you do not have really strong synergistic um heroes and good damage dealing heroes it's very difficult to beat okay uh so uh, uh i was not able to finish off tulpa at all before i got bachelor art and i uh, synthesized my uh bella 
it was not possible because there are not many fire heroes that are like you know dealing this kind of damage and you do need somebody who's dealing a, a very strong single target damage um, i tried using aoe damage dealers uh, previously before i got bachelor lord and i got bella but i didn't work but this one was working just wonderful i'll also test a few more teams uh, using levi out there and florence obviously if i had shane this run would have been much much faster but unfortunately i do not have shane okay uh, using shane would have been really good uh, when it comes to dealing a lot of damage and also speeding up your team but yeah you, you have to deal with what you have okay and you can see that at, at each turn uh, our heroes are taking damage additional damage and that's not what what is good i hope my levi had a little bit more health on him think like i might have to change the gear a little bit more uh, and give him a lot more uh, health but at this moment yeah this is the best that i could give him at this moment uh, from what i have so every turn you can see that uh, every round you can see the additional damage that is dealt uh, simply by being there okay because of that will be uh, fervor and you must realize that if the boss gets this uh, tropic fervor six stacks of this one He's just going to deal a bonus attack which deals a massive amount of damage and it becomes very difficult to beat this boss uh, and you that means you have got only six rounds to beat him that is the thing okay six rounds before you can beat him and you can see those additional damage that has been dealt um, by the boss um, just by being there so it is a very very difficult dungeon to beat um, if uh, you do not have really good healer somebody who can heal you somebody who can deal a lot more damage uh, it's going to be very very tough to do that so but yeah i think like we should be able to finish this off without any problem uh, with whatever we have at this moment so bella there she deals a huge amount of damage okay um, she she's got plenty of uh, damage uh, especially on this boss on other bosses she doesn't deal that much damage ah what just happened why did i lose him did i not have enough hp on him how come i lost him but that should be fine i lost my levi there i still should be able to finish this off but it was so sad on my first run uh, first test i did 10 out of 10 without having any problem with my levi my levi was still there functioning without any problem I don't know what just happened okay anyways i'll just show you the gear and um this don't worry this is a hundred percent one so you don't have to worry uh, you should get this done without any problem okay even though the, your levi died you still should be able to finish it off i think like i should give him a little bit more hp and defense <laughs> i had a 10, 10, 10 out of 10 run 100% and that's why I showed you this video. Anyway, I'm not going to waste a lot more of your time. Let me just quickly show you the gear on Levi. I had, I had to change it. Um, so this is the stat on him. So he has got 5,270 attack, 5,270 attack, 12,000 HP. I think I should get him to 13 or 14,000 HP. 156 speed, um, 297 crit damage. That's the one that I have on him. Yeah, it's very high stats. Yeah, really high stat. Yeah, uh, you don't need that if you want to go for and simply do 15. Okay, you can reduce it on 500 uh, attack on it and like get on 290 crit damage. That should be sufficient on a tool bar 15. Um, but yeah, this level you do need that at 16 and all. You do need a lot of damage. Uh, next comes in Bachelor Lord. Um, his stats are 4,995, 13,000 HP. Yeah, like if I had 13,000 HP on my Levi, he would not have died. But yeah, you, uh, I did have 10 out of 10, so don't worry about it. Um, you, you get him somewhere around 13 to 14,000 HP, he should survive. Uh, 218 crit damage, and he has got 108 focus because I want those uh, ignites to be landed so that he gets those bonus attacks. Um, I think I should be giving him more crit damage as well. But yeah, with focus and crit damage, it's very difficult to get that kind of a uh, stat. Uh, then comes my Bella. She has got 4,823 attack, 1,255 defense, 169 speed, 271 crit damage. And yeah, so that's the uh, gear on my Bella. She's got on full Raider set. Um, 
my bachelor where is my bachelor he is also on a warrior set sorry he's on a warrior set that's why i have such an high attack on him uh my levi is on a curse set and finally my flarens uh, i've just given her a lot of focus uh, and a lot of hp so that um, she's faster and she's got a lot more focus and she's got a lot more uh wait i don't want to do it this way let's go from here so she's got a lot of focus 127 focus because i want to ensure that those uh decreased dam uh sorry increased damage taken debuffs that has been uh, placed on the mobs is consistently placed so that's why i gave her a lot of focus uh, and she's got 209 speed 25,000 hp okay you need a lot of hp on her so that she can heal better and she can also survive better yeah so that is the test that i have as of now done on these heroes uh, the new event heroes levi mikasa Aaron, I need to get a little bit more attack and once I get that done I think I should be able to do which of the win 16 consistently and for perfectly uh, but at the moment the stats that I've shown is sufficient for doing which of the win 15 and I think like yeah the champions are well and good and you can very well use them without any problem yeah so that's it from me at this moment what do you think about the new heroes what do you think about the composition that is shown over here what do you think about the stats that is shown over here uh, let me know if you have some other ideas or some other heroes that you want to use over here let me know if you want to do some tests if you want me to do some tests for you give me some compositions in the comments and of course do like this video and subscribe to my channel do not forget to subscribe to my channel please it helps me encourages me and also gets me closer to that monetization okay so until then peace love and blessing to all of you see you on the next video bye